Okay, you guys, this is for the people who are still having uh, trouble understanding about collecting audio on your phones and whatever you're using for this assignment for sound effects and collecting. Now you're collecting 25 different sounds. Sounds can be anything that you experience during the course of any day. And if you pay attention, you will find out that there are at least a thousand sounds going on at one time when you're trying to do anything during the course of the day unless you're in a locked room or a vacuum sealed room but there's still ambient sound going on with the air moving on or moving around in that room so uh, you want to make sure that you focus and get get your whatever you recording your sound with really close to what you're trying to record or hold it up in the air if it's in a distance if that's your intention so if you look on mine i don't know if this will show it uh, i've got several sounds recorded here and all of them are different and I have them all labeled this is what you're going to do once you have them labeled you're going to go ahead and connect to your um, share on your Google Drive and this is uh, I'm gonna hit share on my phone and um, your phones may be slightly different than what mine does uh, I'm going to uh, tag each one of the each one of them that I want to share with and I'm sharing these then I'm gonna hit share on my uh, phone then I'm going to find my Google Drive and I'm going to share them there. This is uh, located on my school to, uh, my school account and I'm going to be putting in and I'm going to show you. I just shared them. So then I'm going to go and locate. Oh, let me pull this down just a hair. I'm going to go to my Google Drive. And as you see, here are all my sounds here, and they are labeled. And what I did in my AV, uh, my AV production video uh, folder here, I've created a folder of just audio. That way I'll, I'm building my own library of sounds and stuff, so if I need them later for a movie or add them to a movie, it's a good idea. Uh, so it will depends on what you're doing in your movie, what kind of sounds. You want to make some a goofy sound. Um, that you can add, that'd be fine. So I'm gonna go back to my drive. Uh, I don't have this one, and I don't have this one. Oh, can I do that? Huh, I just realized I can't do that. So then I'm gonna just go to my move, and then I'm gonna move them to that folder. So I'm gonna go here, AV production, Here somewhere, I know it. I created them. There it is. Video. Click on here, and there's the audio folder, and I can put it in there. So and I just do each one like that. Not make a copy. I'm just moving them so that they're be in those folders for me. Do this one, and then I'm going to show you where I am. This is easy to find a lot of times. Um, and with a little practice, you become really good at it, uh, like anything in life. Anything you practice, you have. And then I can go to that folder, which is right here, and go back to my audio. And now here are all the sounds. Now I have all the sounds ready to go. There's somebody looking for a book. Uh, here's a door closing. And opening. And closing. So that's kind of what you're going to be doing. Uh, this, and when you get ready to turn those in, you'll turn them in uh, to your canvas that way. Um, shouldn't be that hard so any questions remember to email me I can do a quick video for you guys or walk you through the process of turning them in uh, until then talk to you